9 signs your kidneys are in danger. If you don't know about it already, our kidneys are involved in removing waste and toxins, maintaining electrolyte and fluid balance, regulating blood pressure and supporting red blood cell production. Kidney failure or renal failure is a condition that occurs when kidney function drops below 15% of normal capacity. Kidney failure creates multiple symptoms with some being easily perceptible, while others are far more subtle. Individuals living with kidney failure will typically experience several stages of illness before receiving an end-stage renal disease diagnosis. If you detect these changes at early stages, you can literally reverse the process and can save your kidneys. So, we have collected some of the signs and symptoms that show your kidneys are in danger. Before we start, do us a favor, subscribe to the channel and hit the bell icon so that you won't miss any of our videos. So, here we go! Number 1. Swollen hands or feet Swelling in the hands or feet is one of the first signs of kidney failure. Besides keeping blood free from waste toxins, the kidneys also maintain the fluid levels in the body. To do this, they excrete excess fluid as part of the urine. If kidneys fail to work at their optimal capacity, toxins and excess fluid start to build up within the bloodstream, collecting in the upper and lower limbs. If this goes on without treatment, the swelling can spread to other parts of the body, leading to a swollen appearance in the face and elsewhere. Number 2. Decreased urine output The primary function of the kidneys is to filter out waste products from the blood and excrete them from the body in urine. During kidney failure, the organs don't adequately remove the waste from the body. As a consequence, there is a decrease in urine production. In some cases, people may develop an inability to urinate at all. Anyone experiencing a decrease in the amount of urine should seek medical assistance immediately. Number 3. Extreme tiredness If you're suffering from extreme tiredness, want to take rest all the time, or are unable to concentrate properly, it's probably a sign of kidney failure. Why does that happen? Consider this. Besides their other functions, kidneys secrete a hormone called erythropoietin, or EPO. This hormone signals the body to produce new red blood cells. Without erythropoietin, or EPO, the body does not replace worn out or destroyed red blood cells. This leads to low levels of red blood cells in the body, a condition known as anemia. Considering that red blood cells are responsible for the distribution of oxygen in the body, without adequate red blood cells, less oxygen is available for the body to function normally, making you feel tired all the time. Number 4. You have shortness of breath. While there are many conditions that cause shortness of breath, it could also be a sign of kidney failure. But how would a kidney problem cause a breathing problem? There are two ways that kidney failure can cause shortness of breath. First, fluid buildup can occur in the lungs and reduce the capacity for oxygen and carbon dioxide exchange. Additionally, as the kidneys secrete erythropoietin or EPO hormone responsible for signaling the production of red blood cells, kidney failure can disrupt EPO production. This leads to a drop in the numbers of the oxygen-carrying red blood cells. As a consequence, the lungs have to work harder in order to get more oxygen into the available red blood cells, leaving you with shortness of breath. Number 5. You have dry and itchy skin. Healthy kidneys do many important jobs. They remove waste and extra fluid from your body, help make red blood cells, help keep bones strong and work to maintain the right amount of minerals in your blood. Dry and itchy skin can be a sign of the mineral and bone disease that often accompanies advanced kidney disease. When the kidneys are no longer able to keep the right balance of minerals and nutrients in your blood. Number 6. You're having trouble sleeping. When the kidneys aren't filtering properly, toxins stay in your blood rather than leaving the body through the urine. A buildup of waste in the blood can cause you to feel ill and uncomfortable. This can make it difficult to sleep. 
If you are impaired to neurodialysis, your doctor will occasionally test your dialysate to make sure it's pulling enough waste and toxins from your body. Number 7. You may have nausea and vomiting. Besides all other diseases, nausea and vomiting can be caused by renal problems too. When the kidneys no longer function normally, waste material, including urea and other toxins, continue to float around in the bloodstream. This buildup interferes with many blood functions, including digestion and absorption of nutrients. When food remains in the stomach for too long, it can cause nausea or even vomiting. In this state, your appetite may suffer so that you can only eat little amounts of food. This may further cause unintended weight loss. To prevent the condition from advancing without treatment, let a doctor run the necessary test in case you have nausea or vomiting that doesn't seem to go away. Number 8. You see blood in your urine. Healthy kidneys typically keep the blood cells in the body while filtering it. But when the kidney filters have been damaged, these blood cells can start to leak into the urine. So when you see blood in your urine, it's time to see your doctor. Number 9. Your urine is foamy. Why your urine is foamy? Because it has protein in it. Why this protein is coming in your urine? That's because kidney filters have been damaged and are not able to hold protein in your body. Don't know what it looks like? This foam may look like the foam you see when scrambling eggs, as the common protein found in urine, albumin, is the same protein that is found in eggs. If you liked the video, hit the like button and don't forget to subscribe to the channel to see more videos like this. See you in the next video!